Hey guys, okay, so given f of x equals 3x plus 1 and g of x is equal to x cubed, our question here is, okay, find f of g of 2. Now I want you to think about PEMDAS, okay? We always want to um, do our parentheses first. So we look inside and we're going to do this one first. So do you see how this is g of x and you have x cubed? So if it says g of 2, that just means replace your x with a 2, okay? So g of 2 is equal to 2 cubed. 2 cubed is 8. So now I know that is 8. So now I have f of 8, okay? Which means I'm going to go up here and put in an 8 for my x. I get 24 plus 1, and that is equal to 25, okay? So g of 2, they're going to tell you what they want you to put in here. It could be a 4, it could be a 6, it could be anything, and you're going to go plug it in and solve it to get your answer. And once you have your answer, you're going to go put the answer back into the other equations x to find your answer, okay? Another example Okay, here we have f of x equals 5x plus 2, and we have 2 over x minus 1 for g of x. They want us to do f of g of x. So you are literally going to pick up whatever is inside your parentheses. So you're going to pick up g of x, and you are going to go drop it off right there in f of x. Okay, so f of x or we can say 2 over x minus 1, because that represents g of x, is equal to 5 times 2 over x minus 1 plus 2. Okay, so I'm multiplying, so let's just make that a denominator. So 5 times 2 is 10 over x minus 1 plus 2. This is my answer, and I just need to make sure that you don't use um, an x value that would make it undefined. So what would make this undefined? x cannot equal 1. 1 minus 1 is 0, and we can't have a 0 in our denominator. So that is our answer. All right, good luck, guys.